Hello everyone, welcome to the Geometry Node tutorial series part 9. In this tutorial, we are going to see two more nodes that is dual mesh node and align with euler to vector node. And with the help of these two nodes, we are going to create this model. So let's get started. Before going into the geometry node tab, we will model pyramid with the help of this cube. So just go into edit mode. Select its upper face and merge it to the center. Then we will hide this object and name it as pyramid. Then we will add another object that is UV sphere. And then go into the geometry node tab, click on new, add instance on the points node. As you can see, as soon as we connect this node, the object in the viewport becomes invisible. This is because we haven't added any instances yet. So in order to add a pyramid as an instance, we will add object info node. And select here from the drop down pyramid and connect this geometry node to instances. As you can see, the size of the pyramid is very large. So we will re reduce its scale value to around 0.06. You can see our base sphere is not visible. In order to make it visible, add join geometry node. and connect its base input node to join geometry node and we will reroute it so that it won't interfere in between ok but watch closely these pyramids are aligned to the vertices and not on the faces in order to align it to the faces I will add dual mesh node now you can see the pyramids are well aligned to the faces but it is not over yet see the direction of the pyramid it is in the upper direction and we want it towards us so in order to do that we will add normal node and align user to vector node and connect this to vector and this rotation to this rotation and change here from x to z now this is a required desired result what we are waiting for. Now let's give the different materials to the pyramids as well as sphere. So go into the shader editor tab, click on the new, change the base color to red, close here, add another material, give your green. And, change and close here and then we will go again into the geometry node editor tab and add a set material node connect the connect here and from the drop down this node is for the sphere and this this direct connection is for the sphere and this whole thing is for the pyramids so therefore i will add a green for the sphere and a red for the pyramids set pull set material and now see in the
okay hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching keep supporting see you in the next tutorial bye bye